If you're looking into buying an existing amusement park or starting one from scratch, this video is for you guys. Here are eight steps to import indoor playground equipment from China. And we're going to go through this step by step, teaching you some of the secret hacks on how you, how you can save time while you're doing this. You're in good hands, let's start. Hello everyone, welcome to Dreamland Playground channel. I'm your host, Rua. I'm a seller at Dreamland Playground. Our company has over 18 years of experience in making and selling indoor playground equipment. And through trial and error, we've mastered how to get the equipment delivered and installed safely. Trust us. Let us be your loyal and reliable business partner. With new parks opening every year, the playground equipment industry is booming. As the demand for indoor playgrounds increases, you, what you should know before importing your own. Today, we'll break down everything you need to know about sourcing and importing so that you can find the best supplier for your park. We'll also provide you with links of helpful resources for sourcing playground equipment online. Let's hop into eight steps. Step one, determine your goal. First, you need to determine your needs. To be successful in the indoor playground equipment business, you need to know what your goals are, like age group, preferred equipment, budget, and etc. Indoor amusement park owners and suppliers can both benefit from understanding their strategy for, biz for success. Whether it's providing end users with playground equipment or reselling them on behalf of other sellers so they may get more money. This will act as a blueprint that will help us make any plan come true. Step 2. Selecting a place for your indoor playground. If you're importing the playground equipment to expand your amusement park or for personal use, it's essential that the space is ample with fewer obstacles, fewer pillars. The height must also be more than 2.5 meters so as not to hinder any potential fun. Step three, know your country's import policies. Before importing, you must do your homework. Here are some of the things you need to know. First, know the complete import procedure, along with all its custom duties or taxes, as well as documentation requirements for certification when coming into America or any other country. Then be sure that it is legal before going through with a transaction like purchasing from China by contacting local custom officers beforehand who can tell you if such imports will be allowed under the regulations, even though they are not currently seeming anything against them at first glance, although sometimes new rules come out after goods have already been shipped. Step four, choosing a suitable indoor playground equipment manufacturer in China. Now, this is a crucial step. You must do thorough research while choosing a reliable manufacturer in China because not all manufacturers are trustworthy and competent for the job. Wherefore, here are the steps you can follow. First, find. There are plenty of indoor playground equipment manufacturers available worldwide. However, Chinese manufacturers are worth considering due to their internationally recognized quality and safety standards, affordable prices, variety of products, and excellent after-sale services. However, not all Chinese manufacturers are worth trusting. So you can initiate the hunt for the best attending trade shows, exhibitions, and fairs. You can also ask for the manufacturers from the existing owners of indoor playground industry. But the most reliable and easy way is to look for them on the internet via searching engines such as Yahoo, Bing, or Google. For example, you can use the search terms like indoor playground equipment manufacturers in China or buy indoor playground equipment from China. Second, analyze. After you have listed manufacturers, now it's time to visit each website and analyze it. You can look for their product catalogs, certifications, existing projects, and contact details. You can have detailed conversation with their representatives discuss your requirements, and have a visit to their manufacturing facility. You can also visit any of the exist existing clients for further satisfaction. Thirdly, choose. After detailed analysis, you must now have a narrowed down list of the best manufacturers from which you can choose the best two to three. For the selection, you can consider the following criteria. Number one, reputation. A reliable manufacturer has a good reputation in the market. 
You can ask others about the company or look for their reviews on the internet. Number two, experience. They must have at least 10 years of experience in the indoor playground equipment manufacturing industry. Number three, certifications. They should possess all the required licenses and local and international quality and safety certifications which is necessary for manufacturing. For example, some of the highly required certifications include ASTM, NFPA, CPSIA for North America, EN71, REACH, and CE for Europe. For further certification, you can also check if they are a member of IAAPA, ROSPA, SGS, etc. Number four, prices. A reliable manufacturer offers competitive prices for each product without compromising the product's quality and safety. Number five, variety. They offer a wide range of the latest indoor playground equipment to meet the client's demands. Number six, manufacturing facility. They have a wall equipment manufacturing facility to produce most of the product's components. Number seven, manufacturing faculty. They have a complete team of qualified, trained and experienced designers, engineers, workers and testers for the job. Number eight, quality control. The well reputed manufacturer ensures that the product is produced of the finest quality. They use high quality materials, advanced machinery, qualified team for the job. Moreover, they perform a series of quality and safety tests on the product at different stages of production. Number nine, R&D, they have a high qualified team with advanced equipment in the research and development department to improve product safety, quality and design. Number 10, material, they use the best quality material to produce components which are complying with the international quality and safety standards. Number 11, existing clients, a reliable manufacturer has hundreds of happy clients worldwide. Number 12, pre-sales and after-sales services. They provide excellent pre-sales and after-sales services to their clients, including product designing, customization, and customer support. Number 13, payment terms and method. They only offer worldwide trusted payment methods, including PayPal, Western Union, LC, TT, and bank transfer. Number 14, warranty. A reliable indoor playground equipment manufacturer provides one to two years of warranty for the products. Number 15, shipping. They only provide or suggest a highly experienced shipping company to their client to ensure the product is delivered without any damage or mishandling. Number 16, installation. A reliable manufacturer will send installation guide to the customers. They'll also send their engineers to help with installation. They may also take charge of the air ticket, salary, accommodation, etc. Step five, choosing the right indoor playground equipment. Once you've decided on the manufacturer, it's time to choose the best indoor playground equipment. You can consider the following factors while choosing. Number one, type. Indoor playground equipment is available in a variety of sizes, shapes, and specifications. Use it wisely according to your customer's demand. Some of the prominent types of indoor playground equipment include themed playground equipment, ninja school, baby park, electric interactive soft playground, and crochet playground. Number two, price. It is one of the first things that comes into a buyer's mind. So you must compare this cost of the equipment from different manufacturers and choose the one with the best price without compromising quality and safety. Number three, material. While choosing the indoor playground ride, you must give proper attention to its material. Ensure that the manufacturer is Use the high quality material depending on the application of the component in the equipment. Number four, design. Make sure that the ride is designed according to the international quality and safety standards. Moreover, it should be appealing enough to attract children. Number five, the size. You must consider the dimensions of your indoor space while choosing the playground equipment. It shouldn't be too big or too small for the vicinity. Number six, specification. Every piece of equipment comes with different specifications. Some are standard, while others are optional. Therefore, you must choose it wisely according to your requirement and budget. Number seven, testing and certifications. 
The reliable equipment is tested under different conditions during the manufacturing process. Besides, it should have quality and safety certified labels. Number eight, packaging. Ensure that the ride is appropriately packaged for shipping. It will prevent the equipment from being damaged while shipping. Step six, place an order and have a contract. Once you've decided on your manufacturer and the equipment, you can place an order by paying according to the decided payment terms, usually 30% advance and 70% before delivery. And different payment methods such as Western Union, bank transfer, etc. You must also choose the trade terms with the manufacturer like FOB, DIF. While placing an order, you should also decide on reliable shipping company to ship your product safely to your doorstep. Some manufacturers may also provide shipping service. After everything is decided, have it written in a detailed contract and sign it. Step 7. Prepare for customs. After an order is placed, prepare for your country's custom requirements. You need to arrange the documents and pay required import duties and taxes. Usually, the following documents are required by countries such as bill of lading, certificate of origin, commercial invoice, packing list for most countries, CE certificate, EU type socket input support, user manual, declaration of conformity for EU UK countries, and made in China for US only. Step 8. Receive the order. Once your indoor playground equipment is delivered and cleared from customs, get ready to receive the order. First, ensure that the seal of the packaging is not broken. Moreover, the product received is without damage, along with the user manual and components. In conclusion, with our helpful guide, you'll be able to import Chinese-made indoor playground equipment with ease. We hope that now all your importing needs are met. If you thought that this video is packed with tons of value, make sure that you are giving it a thumbs up. That's going to help our channel and the community grow. Thank you so much for watching. I'm your host, Rua, and I'll see you in the next one.